Well, next up at number three is a guy who finished one shot worse than Simpson in a tie for 18th last week at the Masters. And for me, this is one of my top picks because I think with this guy's iron play, getting into those small greens, we could see something great from Colin Morikawa. Colin Morikawa uh, won the workday. We were very down on his putting, not as much as he was, came back and proved us all wrong at uh, the workday. We didn't have him in the top 10 at the Masters because we didn't really know whether that whole new stroke would work at Augusta. Okay, we were right, but here he gets to play on a real set of flat greens and this is gonna be a different week for Colin Morikawa. I think he saw enough out of his game last week, finished strong yesterday. I think he was under par, three under. So um, this is sets up really nice for Morikawa. And with Colin, for the work day, remember the the big worry for him was almost his wedge play. And when you look at his scrambling, it, it still shows as 184th on the PGA Tour. But that week he had a lesson from Paul Azinger at concession on his scrambling, on his chipping and pitching and it paid off. So that number probably isn't a true representation of where that part of his game is at right now. Well, don't forget that when you were putting poorly, wouldn't matter how good you chipped, if you didn't make the putt, then you're gonna be poor in the scrambling. So we have to, it's a moving, it's a quick moving target. Sometimes tour players can be 150th, Diane. We see it all the time. They fix it and then bang, they win. And it, it I don't want to say it, but I'm going to say it. Sometimes it's as simple as that for tour players. When they fix what's wrong, they're off to the races. 